So let's say the bell finally ring and everybody went but not me. The teacher said stay but everybody went. And then I said why can I not go? And he said no because you are not done. But I said but some people are not done as well. So then he said no no those people are done. I checked and I'm like oh my god it doesn't matter. I had attention for a week for talking back. Then the bell ring again. Then I said I don't care I'm going then the teachers that stay. Where you going to have attention for a year? And I said oh my god why do you have to be like that? I said so 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 very loudly why won't you let me? I'm finished all my work why do you have to be like this just? Tell me what's wrong. The he will not tell me what's really happening I went to the principal office. And I said why do Mr. Sherman have to always let me inside? I couldn't believe my ears. I'm like how I'm just 13. I'm in 6th class and I said oh my god how that's why he keeps me in for more time with him. But one time Mr. Sherman let me went. The bell rang and he gave to a note to read he said. Dear Zoe I have a crush on you and I know you are 13 and I am 32. But I love you and I will always. And I gave him a note back it said. I have a boyfriend already. I can't be in love with my own teacher and I gave it to him. On his table. And he replied. So what we can be boyfriend and girlfriend behind his back. And start liking me. And I'm like no way I moved schools I had to become I don't want a teacher to be my boyfriend. Then two years later so then I went to 8th class I was 15 and then I lived happily ever after and I got a new boyfriend sub like. The, the end. end.